Some more questions continue to linger after that deadly mass shooting early Friday morning at El Cid, a Mexican restaurant in Lexington. That's where we find ABC 36 reporter Anna Medina. Now, Anna, you spoke with an organization that aims to reduce gun violence and how they're planning to help victims and their families. Well, police are still searching for the suspect or the suspects behind this deadly mass shooting that happened here at El Cid on National Avenue and Bolton Avenue. Meantime, city officials with One Lexington and their community partnerships have reached out to those victims of gun violence and of that shooting. Now, in total, there were six people shot. One, one died at the hospital. The other five are recovering at the hospital. Meantime, homicide numbers here in Lexington are down. And Divine Karama, the director of One Lexington, says that does not change their work or their mission. The first thing is following the leadership from our mayor. She always talks about being people first, ignoring the noise and focusing on the people. And so we always do that. Um, I think the second thing for us is not to panic. Like, we have a strategy. We brought over 50 community partners three years ago to create a plan to address gun violence. And we got to adhere to that plan. We got to stick with it. Just because we have a spike here and there doesn't mean we can abandon something that has taken months and months of building along with community members and just abandon it. And says if there's any victims of gun violence that need specific resources, they can call their office to get them on the right path. And coming up tonight at 11, Karama addresses and breaks down what resources One Lexington can guide you to so you can get the help that you need. In Lexington, Anna Medina, ABC 36 News Now.